let's take a few minutes to consider the round down function in Excel. By the end of this short video, you will better understand what the function does, how it works, and why it's useful. As evidenced by its name, the round down function rounds down numbers. More specifically, it rounds them down to the particular number of decimal places you specify, which may change depending on what problem you are trying to solve. As with all Excel functions, you must first type an equal sign, followed by the function's name, which is round down in this case. Within the following parentheses, reference the cell of the number you wish to round, followed by a comma, and the number of digits you wish to round it to. Let's examine a simple example. Say one of your calculations spits out a really ugly number, such as 5.93867291. A number carried out to so many decimals really doesn't give any added information in most situations and you decide it would be best to round it down. In the first line of our example, rounding down to one decimal place gives us 5.9. Note that this is the exact number you would expect if you had applied general rounding rules yourself. The second line rounds to five decimal places, which is again what we would expect based on basic rounding rules. The distinction between round down and just a round function comes in the third example, where we round to the nearest whole number, or zero decimal places. Even though our number is nearly six, applying the round down function gives us five. Thus, it's important to note that no matter what, the round down function always rounds down. You might be asking yourself why you would use the round down function if you could easily round the numbers yourself. The answer is that in most cases you may be dealing with a large series of numbers in need of rounding to the same given number of digits. Typing in the appropriate round down function for the first record and then using Excel's autofill to fill in the rest is much faster than rounding each number individually. An example of where the round down function could be useful is in computing conservative revenue projections. In dealing with currency, remember that rounding to two decimal places often makes the most sense.